Hello Matedistas and welcome to another interesting episode. From Brazil to Real Madrid, Hendrik has appeared to be next in line of superstars joining the Spanish giants from Brazil after the likes of Vinicius Jr, Rodrigo Gols and Jesus Reina. But before we talk more on that, please do well to like and subscribe to this channel follow this page and if you're a true real madrid fan do well to join the largest real madrid community on telegram by clicking on our telegram link which is now available on our profile bio and this video's description it is no great secret that brazil is a hotbed for footballing talent a shop window for the world and home of some of the great of a football past, present and future. From Ronaldo to Ronaldinho and Neymar to Vinicius Jr. Years after the finest young talent in football burst onto the scene in Brazil. But who is next in line on the never-ending list of unbelievable emerging talent? The heir to the throne might well go by the name Hendrik Felipe. Though this might, the bright though the bright young star still wears the green of Palmares in Brazil's Serie A every week. It is only on a temporal basis. At the tender age of just 16, Hendrik became the subject of a successful $40 million transfer bid from European giant Real Madrid, and that figure could well rise further to $70 million if all the clauses in his contract are met. Hendrik's Madrid deal was agreed in December 2022. However, the reality is in his big move is still around a year away. Not until July 2024 will Hendrik make his way to Madrid to become a permanent member of what is possibly the biggest club in world football. Until then, the now 17-year-old will continue his development at Palmares. Hendrik is a left-footed forward who can operate centrally or on the wings. He is fast, skillful and shows a high footballing IQ and a level of maturity for somebody so young. He has been tipped by many as a future star and it is needless to say that if Real Madrid spend millions on a teenager that is ludicrously talented. Real Madrid famously have an eye for a player in Brazil. They have a history of bringing over promising talent from the country thanks to a vast scouting network and, of course, their deep pockets. In recent years, Real Madrid signed Rodrigo from Santos and Vinicius Jr. from Flamengo, both for transfer fee in the region of $50 million. These moves have proved to be great successes. Vinicius Jr. scored the winning goal for Real Madrid in the 2022 Champions League final against Liverpool in Paris. He is now proving that he is one of the top 10 talents in world football as of current. Week in, week out. Rodrigo has also played his part in the Real Madrid European dominance. He was also a key part in the semi-final comeback against Manchester City that took Real Madrid to the final. One day, Hendrik will hope to have a similar impact. The sterling talent is being managed patiently by Palmares and with good reason too. Hendrik is still so young and has a lot to learn. For now, he should be enjoying his football and improving technically and physically 
without being overwhelmed mentally if possible as there is lot more of his career to come. If things go to plan for Hendrik, he could be filtering for Real Madrid in the Champions League as a teenager and perhaps soon after that starting for the Brazilian national team. Pressure and expectation is sure to pour down on this young man in the years to come but he has the talent and the character to swim instead of sink. Hendrik plays football with a mischievous charm. He will often leave defenders visible livid to the point of no return as he flicks the ball over their head and glides past them to pick up to pick it up on the other side. His feet are fast but his mind works even faster. Hendrik is armed with all of his typical flicks and tricks one would imagine of a Brazilian forward but he also has a stocky frame and a low center of gravity that enables him to push past defenders much bigger than he is. His awareness of the game is excellent and in the box he knows how to be in the right place at the right time. It's remarkable that the forward was born in 2006 and yet he is already scoring goals in the Copa Libertadores with 7 goals in all competitions for Palmares this year, Hendrik could certainly be more clinical but even the likes of Cristiano Ronaldo and Lionel Messi needed a few years to get into a consistent goal scoring rhythm. Hendrik has a year left in Brazil to learn and to grow. The, br the bright light and super stardom will follow. Let's hope he is up to the challenge. So that will be all for today's interesting episode. Thanks for following us right up to the end. Please do not forget to like and subscribe to this channel. Follow us so you do not miss on our next videos. See you next time and Hala Madrid to us all.